Spencer, so, thanks so much for making the time. Congratulations on the win. I want to talk about your offense in a second, but let's start with your defense because you guys knew Alfonso Plummer couldn't get going. How did you, how did you limit him, and how did you guys lock down Utah, especially in the end here? We had one guy, either me, Dejan, or Bryce, just chase him around, just making sure he doesn't get any open looks. Spence, I want to talk about how you uh, read the defense, how you shoot the ball so well beyond the arc and how you play off your teammates. What do you read on the weak side that allows you to get open and be ready to shoot? I just read that help side defender. I, I read where his head's looking, where his eyes are looking, and whether he's going to come out, come out hard or come out soft. So if he comes out soft, just give him a little jab or, and rise up. If he comes out hard, come off the screen, and my teammates will open it up for me. It makes it sound so easy. <laughs> it's a little harder than it looks. Yeah, I think so, too. Uh, I, I mentioned the tough loss that you guys were coming off of on Thursday. What did you like the most about the way that your entire team played together tonight? The energy was just great from the start. I mean, we had guys on the bench yelling, screaming, getting us really getting us going, and we were just much more aggressive. You know, we were really attacking this team instead of uh, last game. You know, we, we felt like we were playing on our heels most of the time. Now, be careful how you answer this question because opposing teams are watching. But where's your favorite spot on the court? Is it the trail three? Is it the weak side shake up from the corner to the wing? Or anywhere around the arc, you just let it fly? I'll let it fly anywhere, but <laughs> I, do, I do have a nice little preference for the corner sometimes. <laughs> yeah, you can see that. Uh, you know, I got to ask you, this season, you guys have been hanging tough despite being on the road for basically two months. You're missing three of your starters for major chunks. As you look at, we sit here and, and we're heading down the stretch run. What is this team capable of? Because you guys are very different when you're healthy. We're capable of anything. I mean, and this season proves that we've just been through trial and trial and just made it through again and again. So, I mean, you know, you see me, you know, toothless out here, but I'm still, you know, I'm still out there playing. So, I mean, we, we can do anything. I mean, we, adversity is nothing to us. Hey, I've been there many a times, probably five times throughout my career. But beyond basketball, you guys travel like an AU team just from, you know, hotel place to spot to spot. Give me a funny story along this road trip, kind of like the Texas road trip that the Spurs take. What is a funny story that you can share? Funniest story. I'll tell you. Um, so we couldn't use, you know, we couldn't use maples for a while. So we were down playing in Santa Cruz. So our practices were at this high school gym. And, you know, we were you know, practicing like 5 p.m. late at night. You know, one, one day we get there, the power just goes out. So we're just like, we're fighting the sunset trying to get some time in. I'm barely able to see the rim, but we're just all just having a great time, just like laughing and laughing, yelling around, putting up shots, even though we can barely see the rim. It was, it was a great time. It was a great time for us. I'm surprised that that was the question that you went with, Earl, because I can't believe you're not going to ask him about Kansas and Roland Park. Uh, he, he knows I'm from Wyandotte County, KCK, <laughs> so, you know, it's just, it's just a thing. Goes we unspoken. Just, we don't have yeah, our yeah. front teeth all the time, but we just do what we do. <laughs> exactly. Uh, all right, Spencer, before we go, can I just get one big smile? I just want to see. That's a, that's a nice smile you got there. Congratulations yeah. Thank you. on the win, my friend. You head to Washington schools next, and you still have USC and Oregon on the schedule at the end of the month. So plenty still ahead, and we're wishing you the best. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am.